What's up guys? Welcome back to another day of Vlogmas. Today, we're gonna make a special Christmas sugar cookie. And with me, I got my two little boogers to help out. Now this special recipe was passed down from my great, 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 great grandmother. All right, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna preheat the oven to 350. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take a stick of butter and we're gonna put it right inside this bowl here, just like that. We're gonna stick it in the microwave and we're gonna soften it up. And now that the butter is all, well, it's a little melted. It's supposed to be softened, it's a little melted, but see that? We actually went a little bit too long and we melted it. But now we're gonna take a half a cup of this shortening. It's about a half a cup. It's close enough. We're gonna go ahead and add in the shortening. Now once you add in the shortening, you're also at the same time gonna add in one cup of sugar. All right, here we have our first half cup of sugar. We're gonna let Bryn go ahead and dump it right into the bowl, just like that. Perfect. Good job, sweetie. Next, we need one more half a cup to make one full cup of sugar. Here's our second half a cup to make one full cup of sugar. Abe, buddy, why don't you go ahead and dump that in there? Excellent job, dude. Next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna wanna take this bowl, this mixed bowl of goodness, and you're gonna wanna mix it up so it's nice, nice and fluffy. At this point, you're gonna add in your egg and your one teaspoon of vanilla. Oops. Oh, a little bit too much vanilla. Now continue to beat in the egg and the vanilla until it's nice and fluffy. Look at this, amazing. Guys, what do you think? Mm, that, I want to eat it. Looks good, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, this is a nice consistency. Nice and fluffy, right? Mm -hmm. Now in our second bowl, we're gonna do two and a half cups of flour, one half a teaspoon of baking powder, and one half a teaspoon of baking soda. And now once you get all the ingredients in here, you're gonna mix this together, just like this. Just like this. Get them all in there, right? Now you're gonna take this floury mix, and you're gonna add it to the other mix. Do about half at first. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna just take the rest of it, and add the rest of it in there. Mmm, that's gonna be delicious. We're gonna mix it all around. I know what's gonna happen. I think we're gonna eat it. Oh, we're gonna put it in the oven and eat it. All right, guys. You wanna mix this up real good. Guys, go ahead and mix this up real good. <laughs> That's, that's real hard for Bryn. So guys, it's real hard to mix, cause I saw, I see Bryn, she's struggling with it. She's struggling a little bit. All right, good job. Abe, go ahead, let's see, it's mix this up real good. Pokey, pokey. Pokey, 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 pokey. Awesome job, dude. All right. Good job, good job. Next thing we do, I like to use parchment paper and I put them on the baking sheet. That way the cookies don't stick to the baking sheet. All right, guys, once you get the dough all mixed up nice, I like to just take, make little balls, little Christmas balls. Just them on? Just like that. And we'll make Christmas cookies. Once you got them on the tray, just like this, you're gonna go ahead and stick them right inside the oven, set the timer, or just watch them. Pretty simple. Timer just went off. Let's see what we got. Oh yeah. These came out absolutely perfect. Absolutely perfect. First, Taste test. We're gonna give this a shot, all right? 
Mm, absolutely amazing. Best Christmas cookie I think I've ever had. Make sure you follow the ingredients to the T and you'll get a cookie just as good as this. All the ingredients will be in the description below. Probably not. Thanks for watching and we'll see you tomorrow. Thank you.